Hey everybody, Captain Gavtron here, and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Sly 2. And in this episode, we're just gonna keep going here. I'm so excited. <clears throat> Excuse me. Oh, he's, he's got some loot. He's got some loot. <clears throat> oh, guys. <clears throat> it is 6.41 in the morning, and I was just unable to sleep last night. Um, he hit me after I hit the thingy. That's not fair. Okay, anyway, let's go find a real mission rather than just looking for bottles and loot. Okie dokie. From up here we can get a pretty good... Alright, what's that there? Spice in the sky. Spice in the sky? Oh, yeah. Oh, and there's one there. What's that? A friend in need. Eeny, meeny, miny. Okay, let's, let's not make this too complicated. Let's just go this way. Jeez. So, yeah, I just couldn't sleep last night. Ooh. Wait, what happens? Oh, uh, really? Do I have to be up there? Ah. Uh, fail. Okay, well, I will, uh... Jeez, guys, this commentary is just crap right now, and I apologize, but I'm not completely focused right now. I've got a headache, but I did want to do some capturing. It wasn't just like, I'm just doing it because I couldn't sleep. No, I, I actually wanted to capture yesterday, but I got too busy to actually do anything. So, ooh, that's a great idea. Let's go over here. Because this leads up right above that plane track. Plane track. Plane. How, how would I say that? Wait, is that it down there? No. Okay, I've totally lost my sense of direction, guys. I think actually... Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's this one. This is the one I'm supposed to go on. <coughs> okay. Yeah. Right down there. Ooh. Ah, crap, no, don't fall down. <laughs> Alright, I'm back on that track. And, uh, wait. I took the same wrong track that I took last time, didn't I? Oh, okay, I see. I'm supposed to be this way. Ooh, there's a the train! Oh, that was close. Almost got smashed by the train. Here we go, guys. Okay, slide. We need to break into the Iron Horse trains, but the only way in, through the caboose, is locked. To blow the locks off, you'll need to collect the ultra-unstable, denatured spice gas from those balloons floating above town. How am I supposed to get up there to collect the spice gas? Murray's already commandeered this ice plane. Jump on its strut, and he'll fly you up to a good paragliding altitude. Oh, and strap on a special vacuum backpack. It'll automatically collect the spice gas after you pop the balloon. Sounds like fun. Once you've collected enough gas, you'll have to land directly on the train's caboose. Why directly on the caboose? Denatured spice gas is very unstable at lower altitudes. Unless you land on the caboose, you won't have time to get the gas tank to the lock before it blows up. So, you're saying I either land on the caboose, or get blown to bits? That's correct. Chemistry can be a harsh mistress. <laughs> uh, Bentley cracks me up, guys. Alrighty, Murray, we will do that. And, uh, gee guys, I really can't think of anything to talk about right now. <laughs> yeah, got that. Sorry, I mentioned my nose, okay. So this isn't too difficult. Uh, okay. The quicker you do this, it's better because if you're up here too long, the trains will go in their tunnels and you're screwed. You have no choice but to land on the ground. Ooh. And I was gonna try to land on this caboose without using the chute. 
can't tell you how many times I've done that before in the past. I've tried to just I aim for it. Okay. There we go. Yeah, but when I was younger, or maybe I'll try it again. I like the challenge of having to do something like that. <coughs> Man, something itching my nose. It's my nose hairs. All right. Okay, let's go here and uh anywho there's one two we need five so uh we'll go here here and then the one just to the left behind us and there we go but did i already get that one no i didn't now see here's what i would try to do is oh 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 I got it. How about that, guys? How about that? Sweet. Okay, wait. Can I get on that? Oh, look, a bottle. How about that? Well, this is kind of leading in the direction of the... Yeah, see, right on here. That's cool. Okay, we'll kind of avoid that guard if possible there. Jeez, guys, this headache just... It seems like it's getting worse. Me having my headset on here and whatnot. But I kind of have to do that because I got my mic attached to it, you know? Although, I could pull out my old mic and see if I couldn't adjust it. Because I have another older desktop mic. It's not near as good as what I have now. It's not even near as good as what I had before this one. So... I'd really not rather switch to that. I suppose I could try. Because also, I am planning on getting my new mic and stuff, but I can't do that until uh, July. Quite simply because of money issues. And then July, I get we get paid every other month. Or, not every other month. We get paid every other week. And uh, the way I work my paper, my, uh, ooh, 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 okay, I almost landed on the track above me there. There we go, that's all three of them. All right. There we go. Sorry, I was taking a drink. But anywho, the way I work my, uh, you know, any bills that I have, which I only have three bills technically why well, I put them into three different categories rent and utilities in one category and uh, my phone bill and I have ooh I think I shouldn't have done that and I have my, yeah I said I have my phone bill and I have my truck payment so the way I work it is you we usually get two paychecks a month the first paycheck I usually pay my phone bill and then my truck payment and the second paycheck is my rent and utilities. And so when I get a third paycheck in a month, it's in a way kind of like a second pay or a, it's almost like a bonus, you know, if you will. Fly. It's awful. I can't believe it. Slow down, Bentley. What happened? Murray, he went out looking for a snack and got captured. By Inspector Fox! Carmelita? She's here? Don't worry, Bentley. I know how to handle her. But I don't know where she's locked up Murray. I'm used to having all the bags. Calm down. Carmelita's not cruel like the Contessa. I'll follow her without being seen. She's bound to check on Murray sooner or later. Okay, that's... That's a good plan. Just don't get caught too... I don't want to be alone again. <laughs> uh, poor Bentley. I can I, I I understand where he's coming from though. Doesn't like to be alone. Okay, so Carmelita is pretty easy to follow. You just she's got that flashlight. You just gotta watch out for. Her. And I don't know if I hit the bottle. Was she here? No, she didn't hear it. But anywho, yeah. So while we're following following Carmelita, I'll finish what I was talking about. But like I said, that's you know like an extra paycheck for me you know 
can't say it's extra because I still have two weeks before the next paycheck so I can buy groceries and gas but I don't have any bills so the way that translates is like a, I can spend it however I wish well not all of it but you know like 300 of it and that'll buy me the new mic that I want I'm gonna get a blue microphone ooh she saw me <laughs> alright we're gonna try that again here Okay, guys, let's try this again. Ah, shoot, a train. Okay, well, we'll just roll down here. Yeah, I got too caught up in talking and I forgot what I was trying to do. Too bad I can't speed this up. There is actually a, uh, what you call it, a gadget. I don't know if you would call it a gadget, really. I guess you'd call it more like a, uh, a move you can get but it's not something you can buy or you find it in a safe it's a something it's a, it's a cheat you know that you get a fake dummy you know it works like an alarm clock you throw it out and you're like hey hey you know he yells at people and it distracts them and the uh oh I got an itchy in my eye she's gonna turn around right there that's where she caught me last time really wasn't that far into it get some points here yeah see her flashlight just had such a wide range of view there okay where are you going Carmelita do I really have to go that way okay why not uh, what was I talking about shoot <laughs> I don't even remember I hear a bottle should I grab it I'll leave it Ooh, is she gonna turn around? Yeah, she sure is. All right. If I, I mean, I, I may not sound too excited right now. It's not that I'm too excited. I'm just trying to keep calm because of the headache. Ooh. Okay. And uh, also the fact that it's 6 a.m. My roommate's still sleeping. Uh, oh yeah, I was talking about the cheat but there's also the cheat you know where you can fast forward time which was a unique feature that they had it's not unique but it's something they had in the first game that didn't quite make it to this one I don't think unless it did and I just don't know about it ooh oh that was a train I thought it was a flashlight guard I know where Murray is he's way up there I don't know why we're going the long way here okay that was a guard Can I crawl up here anywhere? Yeah, right here. Okay, I just cross. Yeah, see, there's Murray right there. Yay, bottle, 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 bottle. All right, let's go see what she got to say about Murray. Hey, criminal, you doing okay in there? I know it's tight, but you won't get shocked if you hold still. I'm okay, and thanks for that bag of jelly beans. I was starving. Won't be long now. Once I bust the other members of your gang, we'll get out of here. I'm grateful for the jelly beans and all, but aren't you on the outs with Interpol right now? I'm an honest cop. Busting the Cooper gang will prove my innocence and show everyone that Constable Neela set me up. You mean Captain Neela? I hear she got promoted. Whatever. Just sit tight. I'm going to look for your pals. She's much nicer than the Contessa. Very much. Murray, I've come to break you out. Fat chance. This thing is triple padlocked and Inspector Fox is carrying all the keys. Come on, buddy. You know I'm an expert at pickpocketing. She's tough, Sly. If you manage to get a key, you'd better run for it. Carmelita's sure to notice and chase after you. Leave her to me. <laughs> okay. Ooh, guard there. I wonder if, no, no, she didn't hear her, but she's heading this way, and that's not. Okay, I don't know what she's gonna do when she gets up here. She's probably gonna turn around and head back down. And we'll see if I'm right here. Okay, here we go. You do have to watch. I don't know if she'll turn around or not. 
Oh yeah, this time she does uh <laughs> Ooh. Now she does realize when you've stolen a key. She's a pretty good shot. I mean, if it wasn't for the fact I was walking on a tightrope, she might have hit me there. Okay. I think we should be fine here. Only for a little while, Carmelita. Unfortunately. Okay. Come on. And here we go. What was that? Okay, I'm trying to dodge bullets. I'm concentrating here, man. That shock pistol. Alright, I think I'm good. I can probably stop now and she'd probably give up. Okay. I guess not. Uh, the duckmobile. There we go. She can't get over here. Sooner or later. I'll get you. <laughs> she sounds so angry, You're so serious too. Uh, another bottle. How about that? Oh come on, get up there, Sly. <clears throat> oh wow, she's traveled a long distance from being over here. Whoa, a really long distance. I guess she's headed back up to Murray. I guess she knows I'm about to be headed that way. Ooh. Okay, she's gonna get in a fight with all these guards. Best not to get involved in that squabble. Okay. Oh, I had an itch in my nose. Alright, last key, and then we can go get Murray out of there. There we go. I felt that <laughs> ah, Carmelita. I wonder if I can free Murray. Yeah. Ooh. There we go. She definitely can't follow me here. Oh shoot, I jumped off the train. Okay, that wasn't too smart of me, but I've done some not so smart stuff before. You can't run forever, coward. Um I don't know about that. You're a lot slower than I am. I can remember if you had to lose her before you went to rescue Murray. Okay, I'm gonna stay away from over there because she's popping bad guys left and right. All right, now we can let Marie out. Yay! Thanks, pal. I was getting a Charlie horse standing in that box. My pleasure. You know how I love to mess around with Carmelita. Yeah, <laughs> that's weird. See you back at the safe house. <laughs> uh, there we go, guys. Our, oh, I thought we had. Um, I guess we have another mission to do. I thought we had them all done. I was expecting to go here a message from Bentley. Oh, I see. You ride the iron horse. Okay. Oh yeah, that's right, because we cracked them open. But I think we're going to go ahead and leave that for the next episode, because those episodes can be kind of, uh, not necessarily difficult, but they're kind of long. So uh, I'm going to go ahead and cut it here, and I will see you all in the next episode. Alright guys, thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time. Bye-bye.